Round 19 review, West Coast and Fremantle. Let's get into it. Let's start with the Dockers. You can't win first quarters of footy, boys. You've only won two first quarters in 2023. Another one on the weekend costs you the game. It's getting up towards the higher single digits of games that I think you've kicked yourself out of or not rocked up to start the game and cost yourselves the win. Uh, it's past a pattern of behaviour. It's a serious issue that can be changed. You can start better. And whether it's attitude from the players, whether it's system and structure from the coaches, something isn't being done and it's tying into the, the entire season that's been a completely underachieving one for this Dockers side, which we all expected so much more. Again, Sydney matched it uh, for three quarters, but a 15 to 20 minute period in the game, you lose six goals. That's what you lose by in the end, four goals. And uh, overly disappointing, to be quite frank. Sarong and Brace were okay in the middle of the ground, but you're just fighting an uphill battle from the get-go. West Coast Eagles against Carlton. Really disappointing. Again, 15 goals to two in the first half. You actually fight back and win the third and fourth quarters. So whether or not that's because Carlton switched off or because West Coast rocked up, again, uh, the senior midfielders didn't get it done against uh, a Carlton side who didn't have Chera. Didn't have Crips, lost Walsh to a hamstring. Talking about hamstrings, Luke Shuey, the captain of the side, uh, he's done another soft tissue injury. My take on it is, uh, knowing him personally, he'd be extremely disappointed. That's an understatement. Can he go on next year? Uh, the question is up in the air right now. Uh, what do I think? It might be curtains for Luke. I don't know. Uh, what do you think in the comments below? I'd love to hear your questions. Probably some questions on the other side as well. Alex Pierce, his form. To me, he looks like he's getting some sort of uh, pain injection in his leg. At stages, it looks like he actually can't stand up on his own two feet. And that's not being critical. I think there's something medically wrong with Alex Pierce, And he's really struggling to compete against the best players in the competition with Buddy kicking three goals on him. What do you think? Both captains under question right now the, uh, over in the West. Put your comments below.